Hey guys, it's Osas from Samsung Galaxy S3 Soft Monitor. Today I'm going to be showing you how to get better control of your volume on your Samsung Galaxy S3. Now we've all been in a, a theater or in a meeting where somebody's phone goes off and they look completely shocked and they feel like an idiot obviously and that's because they just didn't know that their volume was on or they thought they turned it off and they forgot or whatever have you. So if you just want to avoid that situation and you don't want to root your, root your phone or get some complicated app to where you have to schedule things and put it in a calendar or whatever, you can just try Persist. It's really basic, it's nice and easy to use. So Persist in the Play Store, it's free. There's a premium version which I'll talk about later, but we're just going to install it and then open it up. And we're going to click on that button to just get to main menu. And these are the four default presets. So it comes with appointment, default, night, and silent. So in each of these, we can change to whatever we want. So for, for our default, that means just the regular, regular goings of it. This is the what it is preset, but if I want my default tab no alarm, I can just slide that over or you can tap it, but you can slide that straight down. Um, media, so my music, I can you can just adjust with the slider with your finger, whatever you want. You can go back, if you want to create one, you press this plus icon right here. So let's just say when I go to work, I want to have a preset. So I'll do work, click done, click this check right here, then I'll add it here. Now from there I can go in and I can set whatever the settings are. So at work you probably don't want an alarm, um, you're probably not going to be listening to music, you probably want your ringer on whatever. If you want your ringer on vibrate, you can click here and just go to vibrate. You can have it on silent or whatever. Um, so let's, uh, sorry, let's go back to the app. Um, you can just go back by pressing that button again and just check out silent. Obviously silent preset is zeros. So you can see that there's nothing on. You can go back here again and you can go click on this. You can sort it by whatever, by, by name or usage, how much you use it. Um, and then you can access the settings here. So if you want a notification of your last preset or the current volume, you can just check these boxes right here. And then here is a, one premium feature. It's called Pocket Locker or Volume Control. And basically what that does is it, you can, I'll show you actually, it doesn't actually work, but you can go to a preset. Let's just go to default. And then if you click on this, you can see right here it says volume locker unlocked. You tap this if you have the premium version. And that means if this was in your pocket or whatever, um, all these these would be um, locked. So if I accidentally have my keys rub against the volume thing, it's not going to turn on my volume past whatever my preset was because I've locked it right in here. Um, again, that's a premium feature. The premium version costs 387 randomly, so you might as well just say it costs four bucks. Um, that also comes with GPS settings, so if I'm driving to work, it'll automatically turn on my my work um, preset, and if I go home, it'll turn on my home preset if I have that set up, obviously. So a lot of people like that because it's automatic and they don't have to go into the app itself and do it. But um, again, if you just want a super basic, easy to use automatic settings, you can just go in here, tap it, set it, and you're off. You don't need to worry about scheduling it or anything like that. So that's really, um, that's Persist. You can check it out on the Play Store for free, or you could try the premium version for, I think, 387. So let us know what you think in the comment section, and then make sure to like, comment, and subscribe, and check out the full tutorial on Samsung Galaxy S3 Softmodder. All right, thanks, guys.